today we're breaking down an experiment that we are doing in collaboration with scientists here at the um, Conservation Institute. This experiment was trying to assess how salamanders are doing um, or are likely to do in the future with climate change, particularly rising temperatures. Awesome. We're working with black belly salamanders, so they're a very large green salamander, and they're actually one of the most abundant salamanders that we see in the Southern Appalachians. What we do is we um, measure and weigh them at the beginning of our experiment, and then we manipulate the conditions in which they live for a period of five to six weeks. Then we come back and we measure and weigh them again, and by looking at the pattern between their length and their mass, we can kind of assess are they doing better than we would expect or are they doing worse than we would expect. The reason that we, we care so much about the black belly salamander is that because they're the most abundant species that's there, their performance is really affecting everything that's happening within the stream. So if they become less abundant, if their uh, role starts to decline, it could be that we see changing conditions throughout the entire stream system. Being able to run experiments down here means that my students can be involved, um, that undergraduates can participate in every stage of the research, but I also don't have to be the one who figures out how to keep all 24 of these tanks running for six consecutive weeks. The expertise that is offered to us here has really made all of this possible. We're such a small team here at the Conservation Institute that in order for us to really you know, make an impact with our work, these partnerships are so very vital for what we do. We partner with other, other people in order to do this work successfully. Working with students, they're the next generation of scientists in this field. They are the ones that are going to be coming up and doing this type of research in the future. And it's really important to get them exposed to this type of work at such a young age. Um, because they are the future of the conservation of these species.